Hi guys, right, I thought I'd uh, explain to you how if you've got an S3 and you, you're on orange but you didn't get the S3 after 5th of September or whatever date it is they're claiming, um, how you can get the quick tap working and hopefully get the £50 uh, free money for registering. So the first thing you have to do is go to a stock orange ROM. I'll put a link in the bottom but you can get it from, Saf, uh, from Sam Firmware. So you can see the details on there, BLG2, Android 4.04. So this is, I've literally wiped and flashed, and I would say, you know, make sure you wipe. If you don't wipe first in the built-in recovery, it won't work, don't you? You can't really partition unless you've got the pit file, etc., etc. So go into recovery, which is menu and power up while you turn on. Select wipe, wipe data, wipe, wipe cache, wipe everything. Battery out, volume, volume down. Menu, power on, into download mode, volume up, flash the new, the, well the orange ROM, boot up, so that's where I am now, and I've, oh, it's already there, so I've been into Play Store, search for Quick Tap Wallet, which is not doing yet, come on, there we go, Quick Tap Wallet for GS3, oh, I missed out one vital step, sorry, you must get a Quick Tap NFC enabled SIM card. There's apparently a Java file on the SIM card that the applications call on and without it it won't work. Now before I went to the orange ROM when I selected Barclay card, add it, continue, it opened the browser and it would basically load a page up saying oh, your phone can't do this. When I flashed the orange ROM it worked fine. Now you could try it first without flashing. Some people have had success and maybe it's because I'm on a jelly or I was on a jelly bean ROM. Maybe people on ice cream sandwich ROMs are fine, I'm not sure, but I've had to flash the stock orange ROM. So welcome to Barclay Card Contactless Mobile Payments. Get started. You'd have to have Wi-Fi off by the way, it must be on a regular data connection using your orange sim that's how it can kind of verify that you are with orange so this is the online bike now i've already got a my bike card so i'm going to log straight in but you would have to register so i'm going to pause for a moment while i log myself in okay so i've logged in that's the first two steps of logging in and then my memorable name and now i've selected the credit card that's linked to that now, I haven't done this yet, I'm doing this with you guys. Oh, so now I've got to choose a four digit PIN, which will uh, be associated with the app. So again, I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to go away for one second to do that. Can you join me back as I'm just accepting terms and conditions? Page is just loading, come on orange. Almost done. So, your new payment account is now set up, and your QuickTap wallet will surely update with your app pay with your payment app. This usually happens within five minutes, but can take up to thirty. Your mob your mobile may notify you of an update, or you can check the QuickTap. Oh, come back. You can now close this screen. Right, so I just got the notification that the app's ready. Um, I'd logged onto the website, the £50 is showing as being there. Um, I'd actually clicked to reset, it had said, you know, please wait, your app will be coming, kind of thing. Um, I tried installing the APK and it said my PIN was wrong. So I uninstalled that again. I hit resend on the website and I actually reset my PIN number as well, just in case. And now, then I got the notification. So now I've just uh, installed it. Here it is. For those, what's the other notification? Saying it's the service. Right, let me try my PIN number. Yes, please, make it my preferred, oh, PIN number again. This bike card app is you now your preferred payment app on this phone over all the other payment apps that I have. All done. You successfully set up your bike card contactless mobile payment app. Simply add money to the new account. Press here to get started. 
So there we go, there's my £50 that it automatically added today, 27th of September. Find out where to use near me, there we go, that's interesting. See where I can actually use. Because NFC is slowly taking off, I know where I work it, they accept it in a supermarket, but um, McDonald's I think accept it. Finchley Food and Wine, Bolat Supermarket. Interesting. So the app helps you find places where you can spend it. Um, I add money. It's already got. It's already linked to my credit card. So if I want to, I can add money to that. Um, payment mode on. Add money reminder. Um, Can I use this when I'm abroad? Yeah, that'll be quite handy. I'm going to America in a couple of months. Right, so now the big test. I'm going to update my firm, the ROM. Yes, I want to just check what this one is. I think it'll just be the same. Okay, yeah, so payment park card is up to date. So I'm going to update the ROM and then I'll come back and let you know what's happened. Okay, so this is experiment number one. Um, I've now flashed to 4.1.1, DLIB, so that's the latest there is at the moment, it's the Polish uh, over the air. Now, oh, Okay, turned NFC off in the update for some reason. Looks to be good. Yep, yeah, okay. So that's experiment number one done. What's it downloading? Okay. Um, I shall now switch, I mean this is very unlikely to work, but I shall now switch to my 3 sim and we'll see how that works, or not. So we're back this time on 3, as you can see there. Now almost certainly this won't open, yeah, because it's not got the right sim. Now did, so there is a direct, direct link to the app, come on back, oh. Yeah, so fair enough. It's a half win. I can I can use it by putting in my orange NFC enabled sim. Um, a bit frustrating. I mean, I suppose I can carry this around with me and I can swap over if I know I'm going somewhere that I'm going to use it. But it looks like I might have to wait for for three or for Barclay just to make it available to all. I suppose. But there we go. So that's uh, orange quick tap working on. A Galaxy S3 that was not bought from Orange. It wasn't even on contract with Orange, the contract. I have a contract with Orange. But that was, they still think I've got a Desire HD, so there you go.